Like always, this video is brought to you by Bottom Slap, which is the pants that I'm currently wearing. They are presentable, they are comfortable, and I just like it. Lah. So if you are interested, link down below. Enjoy the video. What's up, guys? Sean and today we are in Mong Kiara with Mr. Money. Check it out. Good up, eh? <laughs> What's up, man? <laughs> So for rental, then we can be a little bit more cost efficient. Okay. Now we are actually partnering with Huga. Mm. So mm. everything in the unit is actually Huga, like all this kind of thing. Then the partnership gives more value is when our the team, right, the wall finishes, the ceiling, everything, all matches the items. Right, right. And it's kind of light, it's kind of... You give me, right? I don't know where to put the so <laughs> in the house. But, but just that, if the colour then matches, right? That's the magic one. And paint is paint, but what colour makes a lot of difference. Correct, correct. So the I cost agree. is the same, and then we have like little textures here and there. Yeah. Like, like paint like that, right? This is a like marginal, don't even need to think about it, but with a simple treatment like that, right? Suddenly it blurs the... That's right, that's right. Another problem is this. One thing I learned is, when you go to a hardware shop, when you talk to them about paint, the catalogue colour, and after painted up... Ah, different. It's different. <laughs> So a, so a trick is to look into the code. So there's a color code. And there's a universal color code and there's a brand itself punya manufacturing code. Right. So sometimes also it messed up. Right, right. Uh, so that's that's the trouble. That's why if you have time, if you love make to do up your space, then I think it's fine. If you don't like it, right, like me. I like buying and renting out that makes money, <laughs> right? Yes. But but for me it's just like Within 30 days, we can give you everything like this. So, you think about 30 days, we can focus on our career more. So, that's the whole pitch. True. Then, weird thing is studios, apartment here, performs way better than two bedrooms. Yes. Uh, I noticed that. Uh, so, the yeah. studio also can sometimes be equivalent or almost the same as three bedrooms. The d key difference is the luxury uh, of lifestyle here. Like yes. Once we come down here, easily we got like 30 cafes. Yeah. I think one thing is because of the demographic around here as well, right? Mm. Yeah, mostly you're talking about people who are working in a professional job, they like hang out here, mostly young people. So I do have friends who actually started off their marriage living in this area. But once they get kids, then they'll move out. Correct. Correct. <laughs> <Frankie there. laughs> Something to pay attention is the ceiling height. So why is there a drop in ceiling usually for the kitchen area? because of the pipings and mm. aircons, all your downpipe. Mm. Mm. Uh, so usually they all take up space here. So a uh, functional space, so I think this is 2.4, 2.5, then based on the door. So, on <laughs> I didn't take my interview. <laughs> so, so like, then I realized also like trends, like were the, our key, our lead type designer, right? They always look at fashion languages. So for three to five years ahead, they think that organic shapes will take place. So that makes the ID treatments, right? Relevant even three to five years later. Mm, mm, mm. So some key things like for tips, like if you want to do kitchen, right? Choose the one that can chamfer the back, black backsplash. We call this the backsplash. Mm. This is called chamfer. A chamfer. Yeah. Oh, see, I learned a new term, chamfer. No, I'll just call it the curve. <laughs> so, so this chamfering uh, makes things easier to wind up. Because usually, right, if this is an afterthought, that place always stuck with dirt, right? Yes. So when we clean, right, it's always there. Mm. Yeah. So this is a long time brand collaborator with us, Ilongi. Mm. So when we got them in, uh, people that comes in right, straight away, wow, your kettle is branded. Immediately, that brings a whole different vibe to the unit. Mm, yes. Uh, yes. So when you have a brand that normally that we can't even pronounce like DD Twitch, uh, whatever, those European. <laughs> Wait, lah. <laughs> really, one. I go to those. I can't even pronounce. So like, I'm like doing no justice to their brand. But once you go in, right, then suddenly it's a whole different vibe. 
just like the brands for your WC. Mm. <coughs> so usually people don't pay attention to toilet brands. Huh? But the some branded ones will be Grohi, will be Toto, will be American Standard, will be Villaroy and Boss. So those are, once we see, right, we know the level of the property. Yep, that's right. So the, but then, again, this, the Johnson Swiss one and the Toto one feels exactly the same. Mm. But it's, the, it's just like shoes. La. <laughs> Not that they build themselves also. Yeah, and when people rent places, right, I notice in a higher end area, even with your outside design not so nice, let's say as you mean, if you can't afford, make sure you spend more on toilet. Because toilet is something that like, I think especially if your tenants are ladies, it is like, you make sure it looks good. It's that 45 minute inside there showering and doing that stuff, it's a, it's a satisfaction, right lady, right? <laughs> With yes, a big mirror. Yes and no. <laughs> sure. <laughs> so Whatever rocks your boat, no? <laughs> So why uh, the units here have a speaker up there? Do they sing you song in the morning to wake you up? Uh? So I don't know whether it's it by the developer or not, but if it's by the developer, they have purposes. Uh, so it means like for emergency announcement. Right. Uh, so for, but usually it's for commercial spaces. They will have residential spaces. I don't need to know. Uh. Yeah, no. Then <coughs> this is a dual key, like just now the unit and this is actually sold as one unit. The best thing is that I pay, I take one loan, I got two units. That's right. So if yeah. you take 90% quota, should we have got two units? Correct. Uh, yeah. And I want to stay one myself, I want to rent out one, can. If I quarrel with my girlfriend, I can go over and take. <laughs> Cut it off. Uh. <laughs> Eddie, yeah. right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 What do you call this space? I always wonder what do people call this space. This is the aircon latch. Aircon latch. So usually aircon latch, if you look into old apartments, it's just a platform. Yes. They will extend it out. Yeah, they will out. But yeah. then for designs, we pursue more humanity. So pity the guy that needs to climb out the window and install them. A lot of fatality actually. Mm. So so now the later designs are they, they begin to room. Then the difference here is outdoor paint versus indoor paint. Mm. Mm. So those are spray paints, so it's more textured, so when water falls, right, it won't stick to the surface as long. For outdoor spray paints, right, the texture actually lets the water flow back. Right, right, right. So actually, outdoor paint is supposed to be rougher, so that with the texture, the water yeah. flows away more. Yeah, faster. Oh. It won't stick to the surface. Right. So for buildings, the worst thing is stagnant water. So wall shelves gives a lot of uh, flexibility in terms of fixtures. So like these things right, are so useful. How many more cabinets you need in the unit? Yeah. So this one looks good as well as you can actually personalize your space a little bit more. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and it's not that costly. It's also not expensive, but that's a good thing. The trouble is only installation. <laughs> uh, and this one, visual impact. Bagus. But remember, don't put too heavy things. Huh? <laughs> actually, there's a spec specification <laughs> to so you don't sit on it, you don't go and do pull up. <laughs> the, the first time I tried installing this myself, right? I realized that you really need to know how deep that thing gonna be for the weight ratio kind of thing. Mm. Yeah, because what happened was that uh, I bought it from IKEA. Mm. I just drill it in. After I put all the stuff there, it just collapsed. Collapse. Yeah. Yeah. So after I realized that the more proper one, you, you really have to know how deep your, your screw goes in. La. Yeah. Are you saying that Ikea's one is not proper? No, no, I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. I'm saying my wall, wall, my wall uh, quality not good enough. Yeah. Put it in there. So, every time when I come into a property, I will always wonder what this whole place is called. I'll just call it a walkway, mm. but what's the proper name of it? It's a corridor? It's a corridor. Mm. So, for developers, the data point that we look at is efficiency. Efficiency of a floor layout means how many percentage of the layout can be sold. So the, whatever in the unit I can sell, whatever outside I cannot sell. Mm. So then why do I need to provide a bigger corridor when a 1.8 uh, is good enough? Because just nice two wheelchair can go through. So this is very generous really. And that is how I used to 
evaluate the developer whether is this property for investment or is it for own stay? Or is it on a luxury segment or is it really a cost effective project? So if we, we have seen a few projects where it's really meant for investment. The corridor is one straight, narrow, maximized units and yes. assets. Yes. So those are purely for numbers. So right. the developer really makes money for that. And the experience to the unit is like people yeah. don't care. Just go to your unit. That's why the intention of purchase matters a lot. Like for a unit like this, like this is not cheap, so this is like around 900 per square feet. And you think about it, 900 per square feet, a unit like 800 square feet, right, is 700,000. The rental here, according to the team, is around 3,000, 3,000 3, quite easily. Then 700,000, your loan for 35 years is around 2004, 2003. Yeah. Good figures. Right? So that's why expensive or cheap, right, is relative. Mm. Even if you give a 700,000, I want to buy a thousand eight that's square right. feet somewhere else, but the rental cannot achieve. Correct. Right. So right. what's the point? Yeah. And with a rental that can achieve your installment, right? Guess what happens to the sub sale? I can higher price. I can sell anytime higher because right. I know it can break even for you. Yes. So yeah. so that's why it's very important to look at rental also when we buy. But numbers aside, sometimes a project with great numbers, right? Experience tend to be the other direction. <laughs>
the lifestyle means that I can put my camera here, I take picture here, morning coffee, right? I cannot do that in any other places, ma. And the coffee label must also face the camera. Eh? <laughs> because That's the coffee right. labels around here is different. Yeah, yeah. So, and that is the lifestyle that they pursue. Yeah. But for a normal standard one, it's really just for living, right? It's a whole different Correct. strategy altogether. So, like our founders always say, getting the unit is half the equation. What to do with the unit? So then, like let's say I can make this into an, I can just fully partition this, and I can make it one room. I can fully partition the living room to make it another room. Yes. That's also a strategy like that. And then it depends on how you calculate your ROI, mm. And a lot of people, even not human, uh, it depends on how you dress up also, ma. Somewhere very hang on. One unit become eight unit. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Next room. A lot idea. I did a lot already. Yeah. It's already like yeah. 2 hours of material already. Yeah. Yeah. Usually how long we shoot for? Okay, 3. No, usually we shoot 3 hours but it's, they will shoot their own hour just wrap. That's why I don't know when I start speaking. Yeah, yeah. What's the time you to stitch everything together? Why did you come on man? The more the better. Ask the guy earlier. <laughs> 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 wow! 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 So I guess that's all for the episode today with Mr. Money, right? Um, do check out his channel because this is like a collaboration and just to have fun a little bit to see what how normal people look at properties and how property people look at properties. It's very different, very fun. So I hope you guys learn a thing or two. And I guess that's all for those who are celebrating Hari Raya, Selamat Hari Raya, Idea uh, Tree. And but anyway, I hope you guys like it. If you guys really like such a thing, do comment below. And if you really like this video, like it, share, and even subscribe for more information. See you guys next time. Ciao.